Okay, so this morning we're going to try a trick with the touchscreen, the um, Test 5e tablet, and Bluetooth is the normal mechanism, and this little device here. So I'm going to pause it, I'm going to plug it in. So it takes the USB C into the side here, and I'm going to put the HDMI into the multi touch screen. And then, in order to get the touch to work, I'm going to have to put the USB feedback into one of these ports here. Um, and we'll see what it does. So let me just do that now and then we can check it out. Okay, so we've got the USB coming from the TV there to control the feedback. We've got the USB-C going into the S5. And finally, the HDMI, is that in? Yeah, going to there. So let's turn that on. Yeah, the armor comes up. Let's flick that on. Oops, sorry, flick that on. Samsung Dex, it's come up straight away. Uh, now it wants to enter a pin or face recognition. I don't know if I can do that there uh, let me just pause that to one side okay i just entered the pin uh, i did it off screen because otherwise it sort of echoes it so now we've got two displays going on here we've got the one here uh, let's put it like that a second if i may under there so that one looks very much like the normal system and we can i don't know go to google um maps say and it will just load up maps. Meanwhile, on this one, we should be able to now go to gallery. And now the touchscreen's working. Now, this is my daughter's wedding. Um, so there's my son-in-law dancing around. And we used this, this tablet here to record the wedding. So you see, we've got one hour 39 video. Start it beforehand. Get it going. Not a bad picture. I mean, let's make it bigger. So not a bad picture, considering it, it, it used about 40% battery to do that. It's 100% now, but at the end of the, um, let me just make that smaller, I think. At the end of the time of running it, I think it was on 100% on the Friday night. And by Sunday, when it was Monday, Monday yesterday, when I looked at it, a day off, it was still at 40 odd percent. So it was pretty good for battery life. Uh, it was on flight mode, mind, to stop it record, uh, stop it playing. Uh, so let's just see if there's any sound from this thing, actually. Uh, I think I always find this a little bit unintuitive, but... Oh, there we are, Ben, there's the vicar. I don't know what's happened there, but I've got... No, I've gone back in time now. So it's the only thing I find a little bit... Oh, I think you click on there. No? Yeah. Then you get the scenes. There we are, the marriage, blah, 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 blah. So... You know, it's pretty good stuff. Uh, let's go back a little bit. So now it's on no sound. Let's click there. Is there any sound? Uh, let's push this one here. Audio, sorry. There's that. Audio input. Let's go down. You push that button and then you can go up down. Oh no, that changes the volume volume. I think you push that button again. I'm not at the right angle. Oh no, it's that one to move out of it. So you've got a one and a two. Now we go input, we push the two. We're on HDMI. So now what we've got to do is check on this thing because sometimes what happens is that the audio settings, see if we can find it, is on the wrong setting. So it might be set two devices connected. So what I'll do is I'll just pause it and see if I can find a bit that allows it to go on to the correct mode. Okay, I think it's this thing here, audio output on the smart things. Uh, there yeah look that says headset at the moment and we want it to say display device yep and now when we go back to playing this thing now the sounds coming out so it's working as expected when I tried this before it didn't seem to be working so, 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 so there's this volume coming out from the singers So what can we do here? Don't know if that's working. Hmm. 
No, it works basically, sounds there. So the sound's working, that's fine. Let's pause that. So, so it's working quite well. When I tried this yesterday, I didn't get any audio out, and it was to do with the smart things. Uh, I just think that maybe if you have a proper Samsung device, it recognises, oh, you've got HDMI, I'll do it that way. But, but now we've got it working full mode. So we've got the touchscreen here where we can do what we like. On the DeX mode, it went into that automatically. And it's quite nice with DeX when you start the things up. There you are. I did it twice, sorry. You get these little windows, yeah. So you've got a little window there. Um, your Play Store can open up as another little window. So you've got that sort of thing going on. And hopefully this will work quite nice for someone who's a bit elderly who doesn't quite understand stuff, yeah. So the DEX is working really well, I think, in that respect. Battery life seems to be pretty damn good on this little tablet. Um, phone seems to work well. Um, very happy with it. Um, I also tried this on the large TV in the front room. So I plugged the same thing into the Panasonic 4, 4K. Um, and at first I was a bit surprised because, of course, there is no input to go into that. Why? Because the TV doesn't have a touchscreen. But now you can take a mouse. If there's space around here, there should be a space for a slot. Um, so let's put that into the hub. At the moment, this is all being powered from the Samsung itself, yeah? So now this has come on. And I don't know if this is going to work now or if it's going to fight. Oh, yeah, I think some. Yeah, it's moving now. So we've got the little mouse moving there, look. So ooh, we've got a choice of things now. So we can use a mouse to do stuff if someone still wants old-fashioned stuff. Um, or you can use the touch screen, uh, which is rather nice, yeah? And on the large TV, it doesn't have a touch screen. This works quite well. And, and I guess if you had a... Um, if you had a keyboard with a touch panel as well you could use it to to control things that way so it's it's really quite neat i think i think this tablet is really good quality and um i'm quite impressed with it okay thank you for watching and bye